So you read this video title, edit a podcast in less than 20 minutes with social media clips. You're skeptical, I get it. After all, creating social media clips is the most time consuming part of editing a podcast. But I'm here to tell you that this is possible, tried, tested, and true and I'm gonna show you how to do it. If you're new here, this is the Riverside YouTube channel. We have a bunch of videos all about helping you with video content creation and creating and growing your podcast. So if you're in the market for some great insights on the podcasting and video content creation world, then go ahead and click that subscribe button. All right, step one, get a Riverside account. You can try the platform out for free for up to two hours of recording. So go ahead and get a free account and test out this workflow. Step two, is to record your episode on Riverside. I'll link a video above on exactly how to do that and how to make sure you get the best quality out of your recordings. Step three is to edit. Once your recording has uploaded, processed, and has been transcribed, which Riverside will automatically do when you're done recording the episode, then you'll click on the recording from this recordings page. And you'll see here that if you scroll down, you'll have high quality video and audio files that you can download to your computer to edit externally. However, I don't think you can edit a podcast episode off Riverside in less than 20 minutes. So what you're going to do is click go to editor. This will bring you into the Riverside editor. The first thing that you're going to do is head up to magic tools and select remove all silences. You'll see that all the silences removed are reflected down here in the timeline. This will take out any silent moments from your recording and make your episode more fast paced. Now you'll see here on the side that you have the transcription of your episode. This means that you can completely edit your episode through the text-based editor. So navigate through the episode and take out any parts that you want deleted by highlighting the text and pressing delete on your keyboard. Now say you don't want to go through everything in your episode, but you know that you have one part that you really want taken out. Simply use this search tool at the top and search a word that you said during that part of the conversation and it will show you along the timeline all of the points that you said that word throughout the episode. This will allow you to easily navigate through your episode and delete those parts that you want deleted. Once you're done taking out any parts of the episode that you want deleted, it's time to design your video podcast using the tools along the top menu. Under layout, you can decide if you want a side-by-side -side view of each speaker, which you can have with gaps or without gaps, and you can also keep the original aspect ratio so that you see the full view of each speaker. You can also use the full frame AI to choose if the speaker takes up the full screen whenever they're talking. This will switch back and forth throughout the conversation. This will make your video much more dynamic and fast paced for your audience. Now you can also add a background. You can use one of Riverside's preloaded backgrounds or you can upload your own. I recommend creating this on Canva with a 1920 by 1920 pixels canvas. This will make sure that that background will work both on your landscape version of your episode and in any vertical or square formats that you use for social media clips. Here you can add any captions to your videos. This is generated through the transcript. If you need to correct any words, just simply highlight over it in the transcript, press correct, and at that point you can correct whatever word you'd like. Lastly, you can add your logo to make sure that your podcast name is present throughout the entire podcast episode. When you go to export your podcast, you can export in up to 4K depending on your camera capabilities, as well as normalize audio levels and remove background noise. Now you're done your full podcast episode. That's all you had to do. It's time to make social media clips. So head back to the recordings page. You'll see your full episode is now exporting. While that's exporting, you can use this magic clips feature to create social media clips full of the most interesting and engaging parts of your episode. You can do this with one click. Yeah, it's that easy. Click generate clips. And Riverside will generate up to 20 clips depending on the length of your recording from your episode. It will take a few minutes to generate these clips. It will even name them so you know what you talk about within the clip. Now you can download these clips right away, or if you want to edit the way that they look, or even the aspect ratio of the clip to go on different social media platforms, just select the clip, and then you can use the tools along the top menu to design and brand your clip. So for example, you could go to layout, select grid with gaps, keep the aspect ratio, and then add a background that matches your brand colors, edit your captions so that they're easy to read, and add a logo so that people know what podcast the clip is from. Then you'll head to export, export the clip, 
It will take a few minutes to export, but you'll get an email once it's ready and then you can download it from the recordings page. Now go back to the recordings page. Once your full video podcast is ready to be exported, you'll get an email and it'll say exported up here in the top right hand corner. At this point, you can preview your episode, download it, and even publish it directly to Spotify through our integration with Spotify for Podcasters. I'll link a video above on how to do that. Boom. Done. I told you it's possible to edit a podcast episode in under 20 minutes. With Riverside, you save yourself time and get a high-quality, professional-looking podcast with just a few clicks. Give it a try and let us know how it goes in the comments. If you liked this video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. And before you go, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you never miss another video from Riverside. Thanks for watching this one. My name is Bridget, and I'll see you in our next one.